Man, guys, life is honestly very crazy. I'ma need safety. Tell her I can't snake me. Break gun on safety. My girl's so tasty. Tell her it's your world. She want the two tone spaceship. Blow smoke screen daily, so the stress don't face me. I'm going. I keep it factual. I'm on sabbatical. I'm out in Central America. I need a break from hysteria. Park like the one with the carousel. I get it lit in your area. I'm locked to the vision, it couldn't be clear. You couldn't pay me to care enough. I dare you to hate me supreme with the sound through the stereo. First and foremost, I want to let you guys know today's video is sponsored by Skillshare. So for those of you that may follow me on Instagram or I even uploaded like a small short, you saw that. I was lucky enough to hoop at Jordan Brand. They had like an exclusive Sunday run where they invited different basketball players or you know influencers, whatever you want to call. And we just had a good time. And I kind of want to do a story time about how I just found myself in the situation, first and foremost, and just the power of networking, uh, be, I guess, being a good person and honestly, just being blessed, bro, like straight up. I never thought I would be in this position. You know, sometimes it gets to a point where you get so much stuff being a YouTuber, like sneakers, or I'm always buying shoes and the, these things, they just become material possessions and just kind of like oh uh, here comes another shoe. then there's certain experiences like this one that you kind of cherish and hold forever and it's just kind of like mind-blowing to see where i've come like things that you dream of as a child like for example pulling up to jordan brand the jumpman store i've never actually been there uh I, it pretty much opened as i moved out of la and that was my first time being there and it was definitely a very welcoming energy like you walk into the locker room we see our name tags on the lockers and then it has like jersey it has like some jordan tights some compression um long sleeve tights leggings whatever you want to call them socks we had the jordan 34s which we'll talk about later uh just crazy bro like it's just it's unbelievable you guys obviously know me coming from a basketball background and just the love of jordan brand able to do something like this with them was so dope so essentially how it all worked out is my friend gerald ended up calling me is like yo partnering up with jordan brand like I i'd love for you to come out and just hoop and you're one of the first few people i thought of and i'm like bro say less i'm there cut the flight and i want to add like some context and just just some funny things to this story so i got covid was down bad for like three weeks but prior to that i was hooping pretty frequently at least two times a week in uh, maybe even three decent shape then i got covid bro down so horrendous like again it affects everyone so differently right but for me man it was so bad and then you know lost my taste smell finally was able to go back to the gym my first day back i'm driving down the lane i'm hooping again twist the life out of my ankle bro i'm talking it was black and blue on both sides i could barely walk and i'm like bro i was just sick for three weeks and now i'm just trying to hoop and then this happens so didn't hoop for another long period of time two three weeks and then gerald calls me up like yo we're doing this run and i'm like bro i am not in shape for this uh but yeah let's do it and you know, I was all right. I did all right. Real quick, let's talk about Skillshare. You guys know I've introduced this many times in the channel. Skillshare is an online database curated to learning. There's just so many different courses that are honestly phenomenal, guys. Like, if you want to really kill it coming into next year, into 2022, I highly recommend trying out Skillshare. The first thousand you guys to click the link down below is going to get a free one month premium membership one whole month that gives you one whole month to mess around with the platform it's not going to cost you a single thing i truly don't understand why all y'all don't sign up like really you can learn photography y'all tell me you don't know how to cook bro there's there's food videos there's photography videos there's graphic design really i honestly think anything that you could potentially think of it's on there most recently the class that i've been taking is the ins and outs of illustrator by brad woodward I believe yeah it's woodard and it's dope. Honestly, I think my favorite part about it is the fact that I don't have to listen to ads. I can just get right into what I want to learn, take time to just practice, 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 and drill it into my head so I can figure it out. It's so crazy the time that we live in. There's like no excuse not to be good at things because we have so many free resources out here. Skillshare is just dope, man. I always mention this. You guys just do one thing for yourself going into this new year. Click that link down below. Get your one month premium membership for free. Hit this like button as a thank you to me. Make sure to check it out. Honestly, I just, I love what basketball can do. And I always wish I could, nothing really, it's only me stopping me from being able to like transition into basketball content, just because that's something you could do forever. And you know, I spent so many years of AAU, like from a child to competitive basketball, gold crown, high school, college, 
to just not hoop anymore is kind of crazy to me. So I feel like this really opened a lot more doors and opened my eyes to like, yo, I should really get back into like hooping and shooting content with other people because it's a lot of fun. But after that whole experience of like, you know, we, we got ready. And by the way, most of this footage is from the homie Brandon, fire photographer, videographer. That's kind of why I'm doing this story time. I didn't necessarily think in my head, oh, I should vlog this. But now I'm like, oh, I should probably tell the story about it because it was really cool. And I'd love for you guys to kind of hear the behind the scenes of how it all went. After lacing up the Air Jordan 34, now you guys know I've talked about, I've kind of done a few performance reviews, not anything as of late, but back when I was in college and I was actually like at it, going to the gym, um, I would do performance reviews. And I'll give you my performance review on these right now. Really dope, right? I think I personally got one of the cooler pairs. There was a bunch of different colors, but mine, that white and gold just hits so different. So you guys saw the really cool box. Um, played a lot of games. I don't even know how many games we played. I think I only sat out for like one, I believe. Probably, I think it was only one. And we, we got some dubs, bro. Still got it, man. I think if I if I was really in the gym getting in shape like that, it could still be a problem. Once a shooter, always a shooter. I had the green light. I, Bro, I'm one of those players, I'll catch it half court and shoot it. I could care less if I miss, most likely I'll make it. But I do think these 34s, this is the SEM, are really dope. So, uh, Nightwing said these look a lot like a fast car. And that's so true. Now, as far as the performance of these, I'm someone who needs to break in my shoes. Like a lot of the other guys, I talked to them after we played and they're like, oh, my feet feel fine. My feet were killing me. Like so bad that I asked, can you get me another pair of socks? I have to double sock it. Like towards the end, I could barely even run because my feet were hurting so bad. And that's just what Jordans are. Like I typically only hoop in Kobe's for a certain, for that reason, Kobe's are the only sneaker that I can put on and just go full force right away. Jordan's on the other hand, man, I gotta play a few games. Oh, I gotta, it takes a minute, not a few games. Like it takes a while for me to break these in. But based on my feet, just not for me off rip. Uh, you know, I'll, I'll keep wearing them and trying them out, but I think this is a cool like lifestyle shoe. Again, my feet are completely different. The other guy said, oh man, like I loved them. They were super comfortable. Now, homies could have been lying to me because for me, they were just not it. My biggest problem always in basketball was like the bottom callus, which most of us, right? It, would, it peels off or even like your pinky toe, like it rubs so much that the skin starts to come off. Ooh, like that just, that gives me chills down my spine because I just remember all those those days of playing like three, four games a day in the tournaments, feet would be screaming. But I mean, they're super fire. Really do think they've made a lot of progress on, as far as it comes, like my last performance review for Jordan was the 29s. Those were terrible because they had that little plastic piece that really dug into your ankle and I couldn't stand that, but they've come a long ways. The facility at this Jumpman store is just mind blowing, man. Like it is so nice, which makes complete sense. But basically you take an elevator up, you go down this really cool hallway that you push this button and it lights up and it's like, <sighs> has like all these cool sound effects. Take the elevator up and then on the rooftop is the basketball court, which is just dope. And luckily for us, it was a nice day. It was perfect to hoop in. I don't, I'm pretty sure I was on the white team the whole time. We, bro, we had, we won a good amount of times. And it was so much fun, man. Much love to all those guys. Like it was competitive enough for us old out of shape men. We ain't really that old, but. I think if everyone was like in Preston shape, we could really, we could really hoop, bro. <laughs> man, that's just what I love about basketball. But yeah, man, uh, I just wanted to give you guys kind of the breakdown and the story time behind that. And I'm going to show you some footage that kind of has a little bit of gameplay and you guys can just check it out. There isn't really too many um, videos of me shooting, but luckily the homie DJ recorded some vertical stuff for me on my phone. So I'll throw those in there so you can see some of the shots that I put up, but it was a great time, man. Oh, I've been slacking on the videos and not uploading as cons consistently. Um, that really affects views and all that stuff, which I'm not worried about. I think when I'm fully mentally prepared to go all in on YouTube, I'm gonna kill it. But to this day, man, I would not be where I am if it wasn't for you guys showing all the support and all the love. Like, thank you so much. And I hope you guys enjoy these clips. Let me know down below if you guys would like to see more basketball content or what kind of content would you like to see? I know you love the sneaker reviews. I'm gonna keep bringing those, but now's the time to start planning. Enjoy these next clips. Yo, we made it to the league now, baby. Look, we in 
in here. It's official. I'm a guy. Quick, let's talk about Skillshare. You guys know I've introduced this many times in the channel. Skillshare is an online database curated to learning. There's just so many different courses that are honestly phenomenal, guys. Like, if you want to really kill it coming into next year into 2022, I highly recommend trying out Skillshare. The first thousand you guys to click the link down below is going to get a free one month premium membership one whole month that gives you one whole month to mess around with the platform it's not going to cost you a single thing i truly don't understand why all y'all don't sign up like really you can learn photography y'all tell me you don't know how to cook bro there's there's food videos there's photography videos there's graphic design really i honestly think anything that you could potentially think of it's on there most recently the class that i've been taking is the ins and outs of illustrator by brad woodward I believe yeah it's woodard and it's dope. Honestly, I think my favorite part about it is the fact that I don't have to listen to ads. I can just get right into what I want to learn, take time to just practice, 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 and drill it into my head so I can figure it out. It's so crazy the time that we live in. There's like no excuse not to be good at things because we have so many free resources out here. Skillshare is just dope, man. I always mention this. You guys just do one thing for yourself going into this new year. Click that link down below. Get your one month premium membership for free. Hit this like button as a thank you to me. Make sure to check it out.